Okay, you guys are- I'm back, and you guys are probably wondering why we're already- we got- why we're already in the Iberian Peninsula. Let me explain. A whole bunch of save files were corrupted. I played ahead and I recorded it, the problem was my mic was muted the entire time, and this was one of the autosaves. And I'm loading from this because the other one was way back, like at the start of- at the start of the American Civil War. And it wouldn't make sense completely replaying it. So I made a quick decision, meaning I flipped the coin again to decide this. And it was in favor of us just playing this through as through the invasion of the Iberian Peninsula. Big thing that happened, Germany's at war with the commune. And and I believe Canada is at war with the Union of Britain. We're not a part of Canada yet, or not a part of Canada, I mean in their alliance. They seriously hate us. So, as soon as we solve that minor problem... So, we'll be continuing the attack on Spain. I go, you guys are probably wondering why I'm... I didn't want to restart it, and so you guys are seeing just the invasion of Spain. So our whole attack plan here is to break the north. We're gonna try to march the board of the commune and hopefully if all goes well we'll be in Madrid soon. I don't expect this war to be over until the summer of 1940. But the Spanish are completely unprepared for us. But descent's really high in our... In. So, we're continuing this. Reinforcements, always a plus, or a must, I mean not a plus. I don't even know what I'm saying at this point. Let's get my motorized troops. I know, I've got a feeling I'm forgetting to read. So we have Colin, General Collins pushing in the north, and MacArthur in command in the south. Or no, MacArthur's unit's here and it's getting its ass kicked. Oh well. We'll organize a counterattack. So, we're continuing the attack on these guys, or continuing the basically charge with 120,000 troops in hopes to take as much land as possible. I've had a. I was gonna plan to do a rant at the very start of this. I probably still will, but being the whole situation with the save files, it's not gonna be the best rant. Or I'm just gonna stall it until as soon as this war is close to being wrapped up. Okay, you guys counterattack. You guys support it. And you take the time to advance on Toledo. No. No peace. The Spanish didn't send volunteers to help us, so... They have to bear the consequences. Continuing the offensive.
No, actually, we're not going to deploy it now. I don't know, the Spanish army isn't doing that well against us. See, we're risking being cut off. We have to take this province and then we'll split Spain in two. Or at least that was the original plan. Problem is, MacArthur's little front over here isn't working as well as I hoped it would. As well as the advance in the northern front. I mean, we're still causing the Spanish a lot of damages. We'll probably send the first international division down to here, though. Again, support the attack. Continue to secure the border. And the situation in Europe's turning against the commune. We're going to continue to order attacks on this part of Spain and steamroll them, hopefully. This is where we send a few to Guadalajara and order the rest to. Uh, sorry, I kind of, I, I was talking and I stopped talking in mid-sentence. In order the rest to basically destroy these guys, or or basically continue the push while we have momentum. question is, what are we going to do with Spain once we're done with them? I was considering just puppeting Spain. Let's see what war score we have with them. Can we puppet them? We need 70 war score. So maybe we don't quite want to get rid of their entire army. We just really want to beat up on them. Because what's left is going to be one of those days where I, or it's just not working according to plan, or the game's starting to glitch. Cut him off. Oh god. What's happening is... I need to actually manual. It's a bug or something. Oh, we just wiped out part of their army. You know, why not just not. Let's go for the lifeblood and completely. Okay, now it appears to be working. So I think this is going quite well. We haven't... We've been beating up on them, and Madrid just fell. That's just gonna cause an entire collapse. I think the majority of Spain's in our hands. I mean, we take... I believe we take this city and Barcelona and we have all the bargaining chips we would ever need. So let's just make sure we've got them cut off. See if the attack works manually or not. No, it's not going to. 
So under Stillwell, we're promoting these troops, having them continue their uh, attack. I think we're rear base. Well, they've still got plenty of capacity to wage war. And we're going to have to act fairly quick against the commune. They don't have much left. See, I think we've really got them pinned. Well, let's continue fighting in Arsenal. So we're advancing into Barcelona now. My real goal is just to puppet Spain. I don't really want to make Spain a colony. The thing is, we've destroyed most of their army in the fight. Tragedy, but they wouldn't give us military access, which is what we really wanted from the beginning. So we had to take it by force. And now I kind of want to join the Entente. Uh, sue for peace. So I'm going to leave you guys with a question. Should I puppet Spain like I originally planned? Should I puppet Spain or should I just go outright and annex them? They probably wouldn't have much more tech than me at this point. They still have a good portion of their army left. Not a lot given, most of it was destroyed in Madrid. But and our, my war plan worked a lot better than when I initially had planned it together. I planned the war to be over in another three months. It ended three months sooner, which gives us operational time to reorganize, form up on the border. Of course, I planned to pop it on. But all that's really left is for us to take this province, which will fall in like It'll be over in another probably six weeks of fighting if you guys choose to continue the war. I think it would be just to, best to just pop at them. But I'll leave you guys to make the decision being the way I've set up this Let's Play is to be based, is to be more or less based on comments or votes decision. So Mark's 11 signing off.